How's everyone feeling, Edmonds fan? Y'all feeling good? Y'all getting turned up for Pride? Yes! Happy Pride Month, you guys. I'm so excited to be here with you guys. As you heard, the journey getting here was... Yeah! It was shady as hell. I realized this first and foremost, first the fourth the fuck most. I went to go and watch the episode last night. Did you guys watch the episode of RuPaul's Drag Race? And uh, you know, I hadn't I hadn't gone to a viewing viewing party in so long, you know. So it was so great to be back in like a home bar. So you know, when you've been gone for a little while, people are like, "Girl, shot, 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 everybody!" And I was like, "Cute." And then I woke up this morning for my early ass flight and I was just like, fix it, Jesus. Oh, Lord. And then I knew, uh, first and foremost, I have always had something happen every time I've traveled to Canada. Flights have been canceled. I didn't get there in time for baggage, weather. So, we're going to the Delta Terminal. Our Lyft driver took us like way out the way and I was just like, bitch. I was like, we're going to miss this fight. We get there to check in. I'm already defeated. And I look at the man. I'm just like, sir, we missed our fight. And he's like, no, no, you're good. For Delta, it's 30 minutes. So you're on time. And we were like, yes, bitch. Yes, bitch. I was all like, oh, you wanted a twist? We actually going to make it there on time. Yeah. Cut to us on the plane, sitting on the runway for two hours. You know, I was kind of hungover, so I get in my seat, I take like a little nap, I'm like, <sighs> wake up two hours, we, I should have been in Minneapolis. I wake up, and I'm like, I think we're still on the ground. I was like, I am pretty positive that this plane has not taken off. And then when we got to our connection, we get out the gate, we're like, maybe we're gonna make it. Maybe we're gonna make that flight. And we went, we looked at that little board, and that little board was like, your plane, hi, how are you? That, that, that thing was like, bitch, your plane already done took off. And it was all like, and you ain't getting to Edmonton until 10 p.m. tonight. And I was all like, Q, Q. I was like, this is gonna be like a little drag race challenge where you gotta get to, seriously. Let me tell you. Everyone, all the girls talk about how difficult drag race is. Literally, it prepares you for like moments like this. <laughs> where, where like literally you're jumping through hoops, trying to like paint in the dark, doing whatever you can to get to the gig and do the thing. So I just want to say thank you from the heart of my bottom to you guys for being dope, sticking around, coming here to see me and support me. I am so, so, so honored to be here. I have one more little number for you guys. You want to see it? Thank you, thank you. Girl, you didn't pay for these gloves. Hands off. Hi, how are you? Oh my god, I can count. Thank you so much, thank you. Um, but seriously, thank you. Okay, so are you guys ready for this next number? So, um, I have a new song out. It's called Print Relay. Have you guys heard it? Well, if you haven't, you're gonna hear it tonight. Are you guys ready? All right, DJ, why don't you roll that track for your girl?